Hi everyone, I'm Andrew Souders, a photo editor here at Wonderful Machine, and I'm currently working with photographer Steve Boxall, who's based in Miami, Florida. Uh, Steve's been working with my colleague Marion Lee in our marketing partner program, and they felt it was a good time to refresh his current presentation as they begin to focus their efforts on expanding his client reach and engagement. Steve is an accomplished lifestyle portrait and hospitality photographer who has also recently done a large amount of work in the workforce and corporate fields. Uh, some of his clients include Transdev, Verizon, Solus Health, Viva Resorts, Kimpton Hotels, Adidas, Condé Nast Traveler, and Royal Caribbean. Uh, in addition to all this, Steve has also been taking photographs for the Zero Gravity Corporation since 2006. Uh, during that time, he's flown on hundreds of these parabolic microgravity flights and has over 24 hours of zero gravity experience, um, all while capturing content uh, on these flights for the participants and for the corporation. So for the web edit process here at Wonderful Machine, uh, we start with a questionnaire and a conversation with the photographer where we'll reconcile their interests and skills with the opportunities in the current marketplace. Uh, we'll kind of agree on an elevator pitch, which answers the questions, uh, what types of pictures do you take and what types of clients do you take them for? Uh, once we've kind of nailed that down, all of the decisions we make about the web edit will kind of support that pitch. Um, every web edit follows the same basic steps. Um, the photographer will fill out the questionnaire and that helps me understand the current state of their, their photography business, uh, current state of their marketing materials and the goals for their business going forward. Uh, we'll have a conversation where we can make sure we understand each other and uh, kind of nail down that elevator pitch and um, you know figure out what the goals for this edit are or what the target audience is, um, et cetera. The photographer is then going to send me around 500 to 1,000 photos. Uh, I'll divide these photos into the categories that we'll agree upon. Uh, I'll separate the kind of ins from the outs and then I'll sequence each of these categories. Uh, from there, we kind of do three rounds of reviews uh, each time I'll fine-tune the categories, uh, the edits, and the sequences as a whole. So for Steve's web edit, he's really looking to tighten up his current presentation. Uh, we want to organize his work in a more thoughtful way uh, and, and kind of organize it in a way that aims the galleries uh, to that client market. Um, and, and, you know, particularly the workforce portraits uh, are a little... Uh, disorganized and jumbled at the moment and we kind of want to refine this into its own gallery uh, along with more of the corporate work. Uh, we want to make it a little easier to navigate these images uh, across the website as a whole. Um, the galleries right now seem a little disjointed uh, and we just wanted to refresh the navigation and, and the way that this presentation is communicated to, to the audience. The main thing that I'll be working on uh, with Steve is also figuring out how to uh, organize the photos into more simplistic galleries that communicate uh, the, the types of photography inside of them to the viewer. Uh, so we'll be looking at, uh, you know, probably doing away with the editorial gallery that he currently has on his site and uh, thinking about how to organize those pictures in a more meaningful way, um, as well as looking at the way that the workforce portraits and the corporate work are displayed on the site and how that presentation could be um, streamlined and, and better communicated. Uh, and then addressing the Zero G gallery as well, uh, thinking about whether that could be a little more concise uh, and, and showing only the strongest work there. Um, so for now, uh, I think I am going to dive into the edit and I'll be right back with an after video showing you guys the results.